Welcome back everyone, I'm the Depressed Eeyore, and this is The Pit, playing as the Scout, and all that good stuff. Floor 16. Who would have thought I would still be alive at this point? Not me. Alright, what do we got? Okay, I did a little bit of organizing off screen. Not much. Just enough to free up some space. Ah, there you are. Oh. Let's just keep moving. Oh, hello. More of you. Oh, great. Just great. I got mechs on all sides. Alright, we're stepping away from you. Gotta love it when everything just comes together wonderfully. I swear they're just tagging out at this point. Alright. Oh, that actually did really good damage. Who thought? Oh, razor teeth. Neat. That's probably overkill, but that's okay. Okay, we can reload now. Oh, hello! The heavy security bar mark ones are now coming coming out. The shotgun which is effectively killing me. Uh, do we have a med bay? None on this floor. Did I have one on the previous floor? In any case, we... Oh, hello. Tell you what, we're just gonna blow up. Yeah, we're gonna do that. Come on. Thank you. Can you miss? Can you miss? Can you miss? No, you cannot. How's my health doing? Okay, I can take a few more hits. Can I reach you with the red blaster? Yes, I can. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Are you, are you telling me I don't have... Alright, looks like I only have... Uh... Yeah, I only have frag grenades. Fantastic. How's our... Okay, we do have nano meds. I'm gonna go ahead and pop one. I might have to pop two. <sighs> yeah, getting shredded here. Okay, I can block you out. I'm f Absolutely terrified at the moment, because that laser just sounds painful as hell. By the way, this is a Marigi drone, heavy. Okay, hey, I got a frag. Oh yeah, these the heavy drones also have uh, grenades, by the way, if you didn't know that already. Okay, fibrous lord. Okay, looks like, let's just go ahead and reload our rad blaster. Make us out of resting at this point. I don't like resting though. I'd rather just backtrack if that was easy, because that's generally uh, a lot more efficient. Well, let's check the previous floor. In, I don't. It's been a while since I last played, so I don't know if there's any. Yes, there are med bays. I don't know if they're burnt out or not, but I'll check them. That's 
one of them. And here's two of them. Okay. Look me up. Okay, that's better than nothing. What about you? Okay, this one looks like a trap. Yes, it is. Don't say yes about finding interrogation traps. Because all it means is I have less health to regain. Alright. That's everything for this floor. Oh well, say it got me 76 HP. Oh. Thank you. Green traps uh, healed me, by the way. At least for this playthrough. So we're in... We're better shape than we were before. Okay, let's head on out through here. How's our food? Okay, time to eat ourselves a nice good old hero sandwich. melee skill out of everybody. <laughs> okay. Amazingly enough, we survived. Oh great, these guys. Uh, I believe the, the, that was a stun grenade. Oh, it's even worse than a stun grenade. Also, apparently you can knock robots unconscious. <laughs> Fantastic. The good news is robot, these <laughs> doctors drop med kits like crazy. And you do extra damage to anything that's helpless, by the way. Maybe you didn't know that already. It also applies to you, so be careful about that. Is that a servos? That is a servos. Um, it's been a while. Okay, that's not it. Something about a servos. I remember there was something about a servos. Ah. Uh, no. That's not what I was looking for. Okay. Each kit will be supplied with rifle parts, blah blah, something parts. Okay, that's ballistic repair kit. No, that ain't it. I remember there's something that I used to servos. Critical component. No, no, no. 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 Guess not. Maybe I was just misreading it. Each kit will be supplied with rifle parts, something parts, and servos. Yeah, don't get it. Thought there was something else that used the servos. I just cannot remember off the top of my head. Using rifle parts, compression chamber, and just blah blah blah. blah. Energy system tuner. Yeah, that ain't it. Energy system tuner. Maybe there was something I needed a service for, but I don't. I can't remember now. Oh, structural rod, rifle parts, and a servos. Okay, there we go. Yeah, that's the thing. Um, do we have the structural rods with us, though? We do not. We need to go get them. So, yeah. Is that, uh, intelligent targeting? Yes, hook me up. So, 
Now, the thing is, what do I have that's low accuracy, if anything? At this point, probably nothing. Alright. I wouldn't mind increasing my accuracy, accuracy of the Vibra Sword, so I'll go ahead and just put on the Vibra Sword. Despite the fact it's pretty much, you know, half durability already. But yeah, um, we need to go ahead and drop a few things. Um, do not need those. We're taking this with us. Let's go ahead and get healed up. Thank you. Okay, we need to go back and get our structural rods. That's a fact. Because I do have everything else. I have the rifle parts, I have a servos. Yeah, I have a servos. I do have welding goo, and I do have binding thingies. So I just gotta figure out where I put the freaking um, structural rods. Oh, hey, you're back. I'm actually kind of eating up through these batteries now. Not the best situation to be in. Okay. Sorry for the backtracking, but this is for science, and I'd rather see what happens, I, what I can make from this. And the question is, is where did I put the structural rods? I probably passed by them, like, along the way, but... I'm not searching for other things. But I do want the structural rods. Even at the cost of food, yes, even at the cost of food. Oh, hey. Thank you. If I need to, I can just look at my previous video and figure out where that, when, when and where I dropped structural rods at. In fact, I may consider doing that. Be right back. Well, I found out that I dropped the welding rods, or the structural rods, like three video, four videos ago, and um, it's on floor 13, and apparently you can only go back a certain number of floors, and so it, before it seals, and you won't be able to get out, or you won't be able to go further back, so I can't get the uh, structural rods, so I apologize. And now you guys can watch me walk all the way back in the Walk of Shame. I. I could have sworn I found other structural rods. I, well, I thought I carried them with me longer, but I guess not. Oh well. Here, yeah, we'll pick this lock. So I just wasted a, kind of a chunk of food right there, but I was hoping to get a you know a nice makeshift assault rifle. That would be kind of fun to mess around with. I mean, I do have a freaking ton of uh, rifle rounds just sitting around. I do have full health, though. That's good. Alright. We are back where we are. Let's hope we can find structural rods. Probably won't, but who knows. Okay, um... Let's just keep going this way. I haven't done anything in this rare room yet. Any food for me to make up for the stuff I wasted? Hey, soul rations. I haven't seen those in forever. Eat that. Take that. Fungi bars are, what, 60? There we go. Good eating. Yeah, I won't mess with the lab unless I absolutely need it, which for right now we don't. We do need this though, so we'll go ahead and make use of it. I'm a genius. Oh, you jerk. It's just talking about the new monster, which is the uh, mole thing that spits acid. Hey, recharge thing. Neat. Oh, hey. You know what? I kind of don't want to uh, break that door. 
I say as I continue to break the door. And I broke the door. That's okay. It's not the end of the world. Hey, we did find the stairs, though. That's good. Oh, I meant to use the hiver tool, but whatever. Uh, might boost. Awesome. Might boost it by three. Get one more of those, we might be able to get somewhere with that. Orange biomod. Uh, do we have any... We do not. Okay. Seeing if we had any logic circuits or anything like that, which we do not. It happens. Oh, let's go ahead and recharge this. Oh, hello. Oh, is that a security station? Hook me up. Did I run out of space? I did. Let me free some of that up. We'll go ahead and drop these. We don't need them. There we go. Uh, it's pretty hit and miss with these things. But if you can get them to work, it can do some pretty awesome stuff. You can destroy all bots, uh, security bots with this thing. You can also disable them temporarily. It's pretty uh, neat. Hey, it's off screen. Pretty sure that's used for um, making data pads or something. And get some fletch it rounds. Alright, well, any mechs that are happening to be still around are gonna come after me soon. one of those things. A lot of energy bat packs, which would be nice if I actually had something to use that with. But I don't. Inventory is full. We need to make more space. Um, do, 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 do. What can we get rid of? Are casing fragments used for something? I don't even remember. I'm tempted to throw with its stun grenades, but not quite at that stage yet. Antibodies. Element X is not used for anything. At least not anything I know of yet. And I'd rather have 50 fletch hit rounds. Okay, so we're good here. Oh yeah, all the doors are unlocked. means we don't have very many rooms left. Excellent. Alright. Level up might. Level up all these. Always level up to Cypher. Get work on blades more. I'm still missing with grenades, so might as well work on melee. And forging. We're gradually running out of skill points, finally. Hey, another service. I'll take it with me. I have been told of some secret recipe, but since it's not actually something I found myself, I'm not using it. Also, I don't remember what it was. So yes, I'm cooking all the meat. Alright, let's keep going. Oh. You're just a... yeah, you're one step. Should be able to take you on pretty easily. Gee, I wonder. Nope. Guess not. More vitamins. And a med bay. Cool. Better 
to take you guys out? Guess so. Ah, coding avatar. Equip. This is a glove. Um, this. A oh, I'll go ahead and pull up the info. Uh, this AI AI personality is dedicated to doing large and complex coding tasks within moments in order to aid the user. In, or in order to activate, right click and equip. It runs off a small permanent energizer and never requires recharging. In other words, it's a glove that gives you a plus 20 bonus on uh, something. I believe it'll, it's a uh, pretty much anything with a computer skill. It's pretty handy. I will not irradiate myself this time. Okay, with that done, we are done with this floor. What do we got for food? Yeah, we're doing okay. We actually have quite a bit of excess food. So let's go ahead and eat some of it. And by excess food, I mean cooked meat, because I usually save those for sandwiches. Sandwiches! Alright, let's get this going. Yeah, just go to the next floor. Sucks that I couldn't get the structural rods. Who knows? Well, maybe we'll find more. Ah! Look at that. Ouch, ouch. Gotcha. Now I'll just kill you guys. Hearing some very unpleasant things outside. Ooh, a compression chamber. Now that I did have a uh, recipe for too, as well. Too bad I can't search these properly. Do, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Blah blah blah. I think I know. Oh, it was something for like a a shotgun, wasn't it? Rifle part. Yeah. Building goo with. Okay, I... If I can find a sparker. <laughs> I have to find a sparker now. Uh, this game just mocks me. Oh well. Honestly, I don't really need the mitochondria anymore. So I'm gonna go ahead and drop those. We're gonna go ahead and get ourselves this compression chamber. If I can find a sparker, which they tend to pop up a lot, um, I should be able to make a, a makeshift shotgun, which would be awesome. I mean, yeah, I do have shells on me. Bad news is, um, I don't really have much in the form of rifle skill at the moment. I do not like that sound. Just want to say that. Ah, scrap bolts. All right, we gotta deal with mega dinosaurs now. Can I shoot you from here? I can. They do get affected by radiation. to do is, for one, reload this thing. And 
next is somehow kill all you guys. Yeah, I blew, I blew up an ammo box. It happens. But I have a freaking, like, acid monster right behind me, so I kind of need to take them out. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. out of ammo. <laughs> Need to reload my guns. Oh, you gotta ki you gotta be kidding me. This bastard. Can I stun you? <laughs> no, I can't. Essentially, this is a big giant. It's not. It doesn't do acid acid damage, but it can grab you, and it can also poison you with level three poison. All right, can I please be able to reload my stuff now? Thank you. All right, not exactly in the best shape, but I can backtrack to the previous floor to get access to some med kits, or some, uh, lab stations. I have grenades. Yes, I do. You know what? This is what I think of your place. Hey, that didn't work too bad. Okay. Back away. God, this thing's still alive! There. Anything else? Anyone else? Yes, of course, you... Okay, you missed. Okay, resistant boosters. Those are nice. I think those help take care of poison. And my inventory's full. Nope, it just improves my chance to resist the next disease. I'm gonna go ahead and just eat it. <laughs> May as well. Okay. We're, we're gonna do some backtracking. First things first, we'll check this room. I said I'll check this room. Hey, alright. I'll play your games. I can chop these two. Of course it damages my fibro sword, but whatever. It's okay. Anyway, multi-tool. Probably will fail. Nope, succeeded. And now I can use the coding avatar, which gives me pretty much an additional 20. And we need to scroll all the way back up here. New message. 
we now know Fortify Me Sandwich, which I've... Someone was already kind enough to provide to me. Actually, I think this one I kind of figured out on my own. I don't remember. It's that was it. Or maybe it was on the tutorial. Who knows? Anyway, stale bread, safe cheese, safe meat. If I can find a cooker, I could at least make a sandwich. Purifying, uh, purifier cuisine doesn't make you sick, but I never thought to, uh, I'd miss your cooking, Travis. Okay. Oh wow. That's actually something I can loot. Okay, never mind. It's not something I can loot. It was a lie all along. Alright, let's get back in here. It really sucks that it uh, literally seals you off from pre uh, going too far back. I kind of don't like that. There was a place that had med... Okay, there's a med bay up there. Yeah, that's the only mid-bay. Okay. We'll go backtrack to the there, then. It's not a, It's not too much of a trip. Hello? Give me that sparker. Give me that sparker. Uh... Duh, 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 duh. only had something... I mean, I could technically drop anything here. You know what? Here, put this on the Vibe Resort. Okay, it gets more penetration, so now we know what that does. Then, there we go. Now we can go to a lab, which we'll do in a bit. First, we're gonna go get healed up. This is all for science. Okay, that wasn't a full heal, but that's okay. Alright. Now, we can actually go down to that uh, lab and uh, try to work with something. It would be nice to, to end this video with a, uh, a recipe that I kind of derived on my, with a little bit of help from a message. Alright. Also, hopefully give me another weapon type. Alright. What we need to do is take a look at that one thing again. Rifle parts, compression chamber, sparker, welding goo, and duct tape. Rifle parts, compression chamber, sparker, Welding goo, duct tape. Blunderbuss. An improved shotgun which detonates multiple shells in one shot. Very powerful, but fragile. Congratulations, guys. You got yourself another f recipe to mess around with. And I even have room for it. That actually freed up a lot of space. Blunderbuss. Let's take a look at this thing. An improved shotgun, improvised shotgun, which detonates multiple shells in one shot. Very powerful, but fragile. Requires 20 finesse, which every character class has 20 finesse at least. Has a range of 2, damage 35, penetration 20. So it's very it's very good on not heavily armored targets. If you use it on a heavily armored target, it's kind of hit and miss. It does have really good accuracy, though. So let's take a look at this thing. There it is, the blunderbuss. And it's a six-shotter. Wow, do we really have that many shells? Yep, we have five, over five stacks of uh, shotgun shells. And I'm not going to mess with that door anymore, because it'll set off an alarm. And I don't really want to set it off any alarms right now. Oh, great. Yep, one of you guys. That's a lot of damage. Yeah. It shoots two shot. It uses two shells per shot, by the way. But that was, a, that was some good damage. Really good damage right there. Fortunately, thing's still standing. There we go. And we're poisoned, and I don't think I have an anti-venom. I 
I do not. So yeah, we're gonna have to just write out the poison. Um, we can go ahead and use this to heal ourselves, though. I like how she says they're fast, but it's just poison. There we go. Not a big deal. This thing is pretty awesome, though. I will admit. Okay, we are good here. Yeah, I figured as much. Oh wow, I missed. My stats are currently d pretty nasty until this poison wears off. But we should be okay. I'm a genius. genius. Alright. Decrypt. Almost. Medical report 11101. Initial analysis of the aggressive native blah 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 form has yielded important results. A base paste can be rendered from two strips of the creature's fat combined with some bone slivers. This paste, when applied to a defending unit, will neutralize all acidic t attacks for a period of time. Okay, so it's, some, it's a uh, recipe. So, two fat strips combined with some bone slivers. Of course, it only says some bone slivers. So it could be one, or it could be more. The other issue is the fact I don't have fat strips right now. We'll probably find some eventually. Okay, finally cured, and... Did I actually damage it? Wow, that damaged it a lot. We need to get that repaired. That's okay. What just shot me? Oh, it's one of you guys. Okay. In that case, you. energy cells. I don't like being zoomed out this far. I only do it whenever I can't, if I have a, I'm using a long range weapon. Alright, we are doing pretty good and I think it's about time for me to go ahead and call it a video. But this thing is just awesome by the way. Can't go wrong with a blunderbuss. And here's just something I can do with a blunderbuss. Kill them both at once. Oh, hello. How does a blunderbuss work on you? Did I really just one-shot you? Too shabby. <laughs> Very glad I learned that. That was a that's a good thing. Let's go ahead and see if we can go in this surgery place. Oh, hello. Yeah, you don't like that. Oh wow, bread. Can I pick this up? Yes, I can.
Not too bad. Let's, uh, do, do, do. It does have a long reload time, and I essentially only have three shots with it, but man, those shots are pretty awesome. Holy bread and an infinity food. Let's go ahead and munch on some infinity food. As soon as I find it in my inventory. There it is. Eat that. Alright, do we have a cooker? We do not. Oh, great. One of you guys. I did more damage to the freaking stone than I did to the freaking monster. It happens. Alright. Actually, back away. Back away. I ain't scared of you. I'm just strategic retreating. There we go. Hey! Rotten cheese. Who would have thought? So if I can get some raw meat, I can make a, uh, bland wedge. Oh, hello. Not too shabby. We'll go ahead and reload this. Food pellets. We haven't seen those in, in forever. We're just gonna go ahead and eat them because uh, they don't—they are not an ingredient for anything. So yeah, that's good. It's good that we're still getting food though, because we still have 13 floors to go. Oh yeah, shotgun shells. Now I'm actually happy to have shotgun shells because I have the awesome gun of awesomeness here. Okay, I do... Oh, one of you bastards. Go ahead, do your 17 attacks. Chocolate eggs. I've never seen these. It gives 100 food and it's uh, an ingredient. Set lasers on yum, the best egg-shaped uh, treat in the galaxy. Unfortunately, I don't know what recipes it goes for, but... No worries. There's servos. Alright, let's get this repaired and make use of it. Okay, that's good. That's looking kind of meh. Alright, repair that first. Okay. Let's go ahead and repair our laser. Alright, let's go cook those foods, and then we can uh, go ahead and call this a video. Sorry for the backtracking and all that, but hey, at least we got something made. I couldn't make the makeshift um, rif uh, assault rifle, but I did make a makeshift... Uh, at least a makeshift uh, shotgun, which is actually pretty awesome. That was pretty cool to get. Recipes are kind of meh. The compression chamber is something you don't really get until around this point in the game. So it's not exactly the most reliable thing you get. Oh, I can make aggressive antibiotics. Neat. Let's go ahead and add ingredient. Craft. And... Do, 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 do. Add ingredients, we'll make three, and we'll hold on to the last one. This is probably more antibiotics that we'll ever need, so. And we burnt out the cooker, so. Yep. Let's go ahead and just head back to where I was, just so you guys don't see too many jumps of where I'm going. I did do it one jump for showing the, uh, the sealed uh, ladder, but uh, yeah. I'm the Depressed Eeyore, and this was The Pit. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. See you guys later.